Hi guys, welcome back. It is movie week, and the movie we're going to talk or make a craft for this time is Dumbo, the uh, live action one. So we're making a very old fashioned type of thing. This is called a zoetrope, um, and this was before movies were made. And what you do is you look through the slots while it's spinning, and you can see Dumbo flying. Now there's pictures, of, different pictures of Dumbo in here. And so that's what we're gonna make. I'm gonna try it a little differently. So I haven't tried making it this way, but I wanna see if it works better than the way I did it the first time. So there is a big black circle. We're gonna cut that out. And with this, you're supposed to use black tape on the outside. I didn't have black tape at the time, so I just used regular tape. I do have black tape now. I bought some for the project, so we will be using black tape. So it will look a little different. It's supposed to help your eye focus a little better on it. Okay. So I've got the big black circle cut out. Now, the sheet that's got all the different Dumbos, I'm just going to cut around the edges right here. And we're going to put our black circle face down. And when you cut it, kind of try to kind of like a circular shape, but it, it doesn't have to be exact because the next step we'll be able to trim it down to how we need it anyway. Okay, so I've got this cut out so far, and what I'm going to do is glue the two sheets together. So I'm going to put the glue on the back of my Dumbo sheet. I'm going to try to make sure you get up to the edges as good as you can. over and try to line it up as best we can. We want the black on the back of the nice thing with using the glue stick is you do have a second to, to move it. Okay. That looks pretty good. Alright, now this one's got some cutting to it. We're gonna cut each of the, along this line. So the white parts in between the dumbbells, we're gonna cut out. So, like that, and you see how I cut that out. Now, if there's any of the uh, circle that sticks above the blue, you can cut that off too. And so we're just going to go all the way around the circle. And trim these out.
we're on our last cutout section here. Okay, so once we get all these cut out, we're going to fold, there's dotted lines down here, you're going to fold each of the dumbbells in on that dotted line. Okay, make sure you have a good seal, a good crease on all of them. Okay, now I've got some black tape. Stand these up. And we're going to tape each of these along down here. This tape's very easy to rip by hand, so you can just do a couple uh, sections at a time. I'm just going around taping each section to the one right next to it. And then when I'm done, I'm gonna put a, one piece of tape all the way around. Kind of help hold them together. So then you just want to make sure that all of them are standing up really good and that your tape is on there good. And then we're going to take, like I said, one piece of tape and go all the way around. Alright, so this is how the instructions say to do everything so far. At this point, I'm going to do something a little different because they wanted you to use some hot glue gun in the end of a straw and put a, a thumbtack through there. So what I did is I bought some glue circle, glue drops, and I'm going to put that on the very sticky right in the middle of the 
Now I'm going to take a straw. We'll cut it like about half. And stick that on the glue. And then I got these things, they're called cookie sticks. I'm going to slide that down right there in the middle. Okay. I'm going to try to get this as flat as possible. And then you just spin it to watch the... You just watch in between the slots right there. And as you spin it, it looks like it's moving. So I hope you have a good time making this. Thanks, guys.